Two of the following videos are true, while the other one is trash. Can you spot the fake? <laughs> Round one, let's begin. First up, take a plastic water bottle that has some leftover water droplets okay. inside. Then screw on the cap and twist the bottle in half several times to raise the pressure inside the sure. bottle. Now when you go are to you unscrew the ball? cap, the cap will shoot off and a stream of what looks like fog will exit the water bottle. Just a steam released in a pressurized system. You increase pressure and temperature by a little bit. Some water evaporates, pressure was released, temperature fell, and water vapor condensed into tiny droplets forming that little fog. If your friend accidentally puts a permanent marker near your whiteboard and you use it to write on the whiteboard, Real? fear not because you can just take a dry erase marker and draw over the permanent marker. Now you can erase it like usual and the permanent marker is removed. I mean, that's decontamination with solvents. Dry erase markers don't bind strongly, and when you write over it, it acts as a carrier solvent. Just like a chemical solvent flush to remove a contaminant layer on a metal surface in a nuclear plant. You might have seen a visual of our solar system like this, where all the planets orbit in the same plane. However, in sure. reality, they all orbit in completely different planes, most notably with Mars. I mean, they're not exactly the same, but they're a lot closer to one plane. Mars orbiting in a plane almost perpendicular to Earth. No. That's not at all how the planets formed. It formed around a rotating, flattened protoplanetary disk and has been a stable system operating in a cycle for billions of years, just like how nuclear power plants operate. You've seen all three videos now. Pause to vote in the comments which one you thought was fake. If you thought planets actually, the planets. actually orbit in completely different planes, you'd be wrong.